Hello guys, this is uh, Clay Chevy's again, and uh, I saw something on Dr. Cranky's show the other day, and being new to modeling, or ba being new getting back into modeling, I was kind of intrigued about it. Now this is your standard clothespin that we've all seen and used, and we use it for various things like, you know, holding parts together and whatnot. Well, Dr. Cranky had a, a different version on it, and I thought it was really neat. And it was this clothespin. And because you got the flat side, you can hold things a lot better. You know, the round side is great for holding transmissions and whatnot together. Because you can fit in the little hole, you know, go together. But what if you got something that's a little smaller or you need, you need to hold together like this on the side? You know, I thought, wow, that's really neat. How did he do that? Well... You take your ordinary clothespin, you know, like this one here, and you just pop the side out and push the other side in. And depending on where you want it, you know, like if you want it to close on the front, like this one, you put the spring further back. If you want it to close like this one, you put the spring further towards the front part. So you take that, you push it through, you can put it at that first notch there, that little clip, slide the other one out, turn it around, shove it back in, and there you get the front closing one. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. You can also take it and turn it around so that the spring is in this notch. I'm going to get this apart and slide the other one through there. And now you got this flat one. So, a couple variations on the clothespin thanks to Dr. Cranky and the laboratory thanks doc that's all I got guys I'll try to come up with another tip for you I uh, don't have any models to show you I haven't finished the Hawaiian been real busy with work and I'm um, planning a convention for our union uh, our state union and uh, yes I'm a union thug uh, but as soon as the convention is over, which will be next month, I'll be back to building and back to relaxing. And hopefully I'll be able to get the Hawaiian finished and start working on some other projects because i got well over 90 cars now to build. Uh, some of the friends from my modeling club have given me and I've bought them on eBay and whatnot. So, got to get to them. So, you guys, happy styrene addiction as Dr. Cranky says. Bye-bye now.